You're back again with another video guys and today we got a lot that we got to talk about because we're going to be getting a lot of new content added in NBA 2K22 my team now some of it we do already know because it ended up getting leaked some of it is going to be coming out during All-Star Weekend and there's actually some other stuff that I do want to get to add for Valentine's Day for All-Star Weekend and if you guys are like me and you want to see some amazing stuff get added like some player login codes some amazing stuff get added to the token market and some potential amazing dark matters too then definitely leave a like right on the video subscribe to the channel with notifications on it and let me know down below in the comments what you guys want to see maybe you want to see a certain player Maybe you want to see an event. Maybe you want to see something come out for you know Valentine's Day Whether it's a logger code or maybe you want to see some other stuff get added like free packs for all-star weekend Just let me know down below in the comments and in this video right here We are gonna be talking about stuff that we do already know that is gonna be coming out And then also stuff that I do want to see get added and some predictions and we're gonna get right into it So the first thing that we do got to mention is the fact that 2k is going to be updating the token market Which at this point i'm just hoping they end up adding something amazing right now last time they ended up updating this They ended up adding a diamond shoe boost token market pack which uh, you know was 30 tokens for one boost which as you can see that's like the worst thing they've ever added so i'm hoping that this time they end up adding some amazing stuff i'm assuming they'll probably just end up adding another pack which uh, is gonna be you know an old pack out there with some players but i am hoping that maybe they do give us some exclusive players in the token market maybe some hall of fame badges maybe just stuff that we actually do want to buy with our tokens instead of this trash that we ended up getting last time and so you guys can see right there less than 24 hours we are going to be getting a new token market update and so that right there let me know what you guys want to see i just want to see like i said maybe a player get added maybe a guaranteed pin diamond pack maybe a guaranteed hall of fame badge I just want to see stuff like that get added or maybe some packs that we actually do want to open with maybe guaranteed diamonds, pink diamonds, maybe even a galaxy opal at some point would be pretty cool. I just really hope that it's something better than the diamond shoe boost, which at this point it better be because this is probably like the worst thing they've ever added. And so that's one update that we are going to be getting in my team. The token market is going to be getting updated once again in less than 24 hours. And then now we got to talk about the dark matter packs that 2K ended up leaking. A lot of people right now had some questions about this. And I mean, with 2K, you never really truly know, but I do feel like with these packs right here they are going to be coming out during all-star weekend so i really don't expect them to come out this weekend but again anything can happen so they could come out this weekend or they could come out next weekend during the all-star events and the all-star game and so definitely keep that in mind you guys can also see that we are going to be getting dark matter kobe dark matter tracy mcgrady and dark matter westbrook right there and we are going to be getting some other players included in the packs too and some people were also wondering why it said limit of three like are you only going to be able to buy three packs no this right is just a visual glitch 2k does this from time to time earlier on in the year they ended up doing it with the moment and those moments we didn't really see until like two weeks later and so i feel like it's gonna be the same thing with these packs right here just because you know it is going to be all-star weekend next weekend this weekend we do have the sewer bowl we do have valentine's day coming around the corner as well so i'm sure we're gonna be getting some more content with valentine's day at least i hope so maybe a logger code and we'll talk about that a little bit later in this video too and i'll be going over some players that i do want to see also get added on top of kobe westbrook and russell westbrook now i do want to talk about really quickly about a logger code that 2k ended up releasing last year and you guys can see it right here on the screen they ended up releasing seeing a valentine's day logger code it was limited for like 24 hours and so you had to put it in right away now this was for 2k21 now you can see it is a pink diamond kevin love it was guaranteed it said use this logger code for a guaranteed pink diamond kevin love card in my team and then it said available until midnight actually it was less than 24 hours basically and if you put it in you ended up getting a free pink diamond kevin love now this is actually not the first time that 2k ended up giving us a kevin love for a logger code for valentine's day they have done this multiple times and i'm really hoping that this year they do the same thing i think at the moment like if you check my team there's already a pink diamond kevin love let me just take a look just to confirm because i think we ended up getting one for the new year packs and kevin love right here bam so we do already have a pink diamond one he is an evolution we do have the amethyst one and then we have the other kevin loves as well and so at this point since we do have a pink diamond kevin love already i'm really hoping that Tuga does end up giving us a galaxy opo kevin love logger code they can just make him a 97 overall it doesn't have to be anything crazy i just want Tuga to give us some amazing stuff you know for valentine's day for the all-star events and just in general i want them to finish off this season very strong because they've been doing a very good job with a lot of free content and i do want to hear what you guys think about this right here because i'm really hoping that they do end up doing something amazing like this for valentine's day because i feel like a kevin love free card wouldn't even be game breaking it would just be really cool just to add it or they can even make it through an agenda as well we've seen some galaxy opals get added like tatum and some other galaxy opals that were free this season so i'm hoping we do end up seeing something like that i know it's you know valentine's day so maybe it'll probably just be a pink diamond but at the same time though they can actually make him an evolution card kind of like the one that we have already but then they make him up to a galaxy opal and then at that point, that would be the best way to go about it, in my opinion. Just give us a logger code. We get a pink diamond, Kevin Love. And then you guys score a certain amount of points. 
get some rebounds, get some assists, and then once you end up doing that, you can Evo him all the way to a Galaxy Opal. And again, it doesn't have to be anything broken, anything too overpowered. I just want 2K to do this once again because they have done it in previous 2Ks. Not only last year, but they've done it before too, where they just give us a free guaranteed Pink Diamond Kevin Love Logger Code for Valentine's Day. And I feel like 2K can definitely show us a lot of love. You see what I did there right there? They can definitely show us some love and drop a nice little Pink Diamond Kevin Love Logger Code. Let me know if you guys do want to see that. Maybe you want to see a different player. Maybe you just want to see, you know, something way bigger and better than what we've been getting from Logger Codes. Just let me know down below in the comments as always what you guys want to see too. And Valentine's Day at this point is only a few days away so hopefully we do end up seeing that logger code now also something that 2k ended up adding last year they ended up giving us some free all-star packs you guys can see the screenshot right here they basically ended up counting down the days up until the all-star events now last year they ended up doing it where everything was going on on the same day on sunday we had the three-point contest the skills challenge the dunk contest the all-star game everything happened all in one day and so 2k ended up doing a nice little countdown where we saw seven six five four three two one and then we ended up getting a free pack every single day that you logged in now when it comes to the free packs you Usually 2K doesn't really do a great job, even though I feel like this season they definitely did pick it up though. So I'm hoping that they do end up having something amazing planned with the free packs, at least if they do bring it back. This is something that I do want 2K to bring back. Now we do know that we're going to be getting the Dark Matter packs. We know the token market is going to be getting updated. Now the logger code and also these free packs right here are basically what I want to see get added because we have seen it before. And so I feel like 2K could definitely just, you know, redo it. I mean, they don't have to do anything crazy. Just be like, hey, we've done it before. And let's just do it again. Let's give everybody some free packs for All-Star Weekend. Let's give everybody a free Kevin Love Logger Code, whether it's a Galaxy Up One Evolution card, just a Pink Diamond. I do want to see that. And so there's a lot that's coming. And then also with the All-Star Weekend events, like the three-point contest, we're going to be seeing Trey Young, Luke Kennard, Towns, we got Bane, we got Patty Mills, we got Fred, Zach Levine, and CJ McCollum as well. So they're all going to be in the three-point contest. And now 2K usually does end up giving us a moments card, even though this year they have been doing moments differently where they do moments of the month. But I do hope that they do end up releasing a player, basically whoever ends up winning. Hopefully we do end up seeing maybe a Galaxy Opal player. Maybe a Galaxy Opal Zach Levine would be pretty cool if he ends up winning it. If Trey Young wins it, he can get a Galaxy Opal too. And it could just be any of these players right here. You never know what happens during the three-point contest because, you know, people get nervous. Some people, you know, definitely perform during pressure and so we'll definitely see what happens with that but definitely some potential right here too when it comes to the three-point contest the same thing can be said about the skills challenge as well we got players like scotty we got you know players like josh giddy we got ourselves jared allen Cade, mobley we even got Giannis in here dude if Giannis messes around and ends up winning it that's gonna be crazy getting a moment's Giannis. we do also have darius as well he ended up getting a pink diamond recently too and we got the dunk contest as well whoever ends up winning this one could also end up getting a moments player i would not mind seeing any of these players either i really just want to see it doesn't really matter who wins in my opinion i just want to see more content get added in my team so if Jalen green wants to win it that's amazing if Giannis wants to mess around and wins the skill challenge that's amazing too and then we do have the actual game itself that's going to be you know rewarding somebody the mvp trophy and that could also be something crazy on top of everything else that we are going to be getting in my team now when it comes to some players like i mentioned in the beginning we do have those dark matter packs that got leaked and so we do know that kobe westbrook and tracy mcgrady they're going to be coming out and so we already know that we are going to be getting those three players right there and more people ended up making some more cards on 2kdb we have the beautiful kobe bean bryant's right here bro dark matter kobe you know we're going to be doing a big pack opening whenever 2k decides to drop these packs right here this is a beautiful card we do also have tracy mcgrady who is going to be getting that dark matter player as well and then we do have russell westbrook too and so those three already are like the big hitters but then we're also going to be seeing some more players because you can see that they are going to be guaranteed so it's going to be a promo kind of like the b set we had last time kind of like the new year set we had as well and with all-star weekend being next weekend i do feel like 2k could potentially push those packs back until next weekend and then this weekend we do see something else now some players that we could be seeing is maybe a ben simmons i feel like with 2k releasing a lot of point guards now they're waiting until they release all those and then they're going to be giving us the cheese like maybe a point guard ben simmons and with the way that 2k has been releasing a lot of point guards i definitely do see ben simmons potentially getting a card because every year we do end up getting one i'm actually surprised that we haven't even seen a diamond point guard ben simmons because usually every 2k we at least see one of those and so we could definitely see a ben simmons another player that i do want to see is blake griffin you guys know with all-star packs we gotta have a Blake Griffin. I wouldn't be surprised if we do end up seeing a Galaxy Opal one. Just because you know what he did during the dunk contest. Definitely a big.
big all-star when you think of the all-star games and the all-star weekend Blake Griffin definitely does come to mind as well along with other great players too and so I wouldn't be surprised to see maybe a galaxy with Blake Griffin another player that I feel like we could see is Scotty Barnes if he does end the winning you know the contest right there so if he ends up winning he should be getting a moments card it could be a pink diamond it could be a diamond it could be a galaxy opal I do want to see him potentially maybe win and maybe we'll see him get a moments card too and then another player Andrew Wiggins out here you know he ended up becoming an all-star as well and that right there's already crazy in itself so if he ends up doing something crazy during the all-star game or maybe he just ends up getting you know a card for the all-star packs we could definitely be seeing a really good Andrew Wiggins and another player that I could definitely see to get add for all-star packs and all-star weekend is of course Vince Carter half man half amazing there's definitely a bunch of other players too like Michael Jordan Bob Pettit we've had a lot of great players play in the all-star game during the events as well three-point contest skills challenge dunk contest and so the possibilities are definitely endless when it comes to the all-star packs and it's gonna be crazy because we already do know that the three dark matters are coming Kobe Westbrook and Tracy McGrady so everything else is gonna be even crazier and just insane and so we're gonna be getting a lot of content added in my team for this year in 2k22 and hopefully they do end up doing some amazing stuff for all-star weekend Valentine's Day the token market etc quick little recap once again 100% we are going to be getting a new token market update whether it's good or bad that's up to 2k we're gonna see what happens I have no idea what they got planned with the token market I'm just hoping for some amazing stuff so the token market it is gonna be getting updated they did end up leaking those dark matter packs as well so we're gonna be getting the dark matters we're gonna be getting all-star packs too and then some stuff that I do want to see 2k bring back this year for 2k22 that we saw before is of course the logger code for Kevin Love hopefully we see a galaxy opal or even a pink diamond that can evo to a galaxy opal and I do want them to also bring back the free all-star packs just for some more free stuff that a lot of people can get and just bigger and better content and for now we're gonna call it right here we're gonna be getting some amazing stuff and we could also potentially be seeing some even bigger and better stuff so definitely stay tuned for that and if you guys did enjoy this video and you want to see amazing things get added then you know what to do leave a like right now subscribe to the channel with notifications on make sure to also comment down below and if you guys did enjoy this video check out the other videos that I uploaded I ended up opening every single guaranteed galaxy silver box I ended up opening those packs again go check it out check out the other video I ended up uploading where we ended up getting the first dark matter and then check out this other upload and as always thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video